two. We have another dungeon I've never seen before. <coughs> and this one's apparently a cult. So. Let's head on in. Let me see. The team I'll be using is... This one. Yeah. One of them's poison and one of them's level four, so you know we're ready for whatever horrors lay within this place, right? Ah, uh, I don't remember what kind of person I'm supposed to send up this chapter. I've been out of town for a few days. I had been writing things down, but I can't find the note. <laughs> so, that's gonna be interesting. Anyway, whatever, let's do this cult. <clears throat> Gorha Gorhla Cult Headquarters. Shrine of the demon worshipping Gor Gorhla cultists. As sinister presence can be felt emanating from its heart. It seems they have summoned forth a great demon who is seeking vengeance on all of humanity. Something must be done quickly! Unless you're in hard mode, in which case we'll just ignore the demon. Yes. And nothing happens. Nothing to worry about. A Ragnarok will probably come along before the demon can cause any real trouble anyway. Look at this, we have another unique looking area. I've never seen that fence back there. Why what, what, what is there a rock here? Maybe it's a skull. Maybe it's a turd. Regardless, I can't interact with it. These pillars are the perfect things to hide an enemy behind. Okay, now there's more of them. Sure I can't interact with them somehow? They're not going to be a puzzle? These worn steps. Rough cut. With cracks in them. And this railing. Why would you cut all the... Uh, I keep asking the same question every time. Why isn't this in hard mode? Why hide something like this? We clearly put a lot of effort into it. Gods! Um... Is it a little bit early to be finding, like, the strongest skill in the game? Hold on, my fingers have been playing Dark Souls. They need to get used to uh, this game's controls again. Guess I have guts. Cool. Alright, we have four directions. I choose the library. And it really is a library. You can see it in the door. Nice touch. Why did you make it, though, if there's nothing in it? What? Why is this here if I can't find anything or interact with it? There's not even an enemy. <laughs> can't even knock over a bookshelf or XP or anything. Huh. Cult is uh, a bunch of bibliophiles, a bunch of nerds, <coughs> summoning their nerdy demons. Are they really summoning a demon, or are they just playing Dungeons and Dragons in the basement? And Odin's like, it sounds like they're doing demon summoning to me. Go down, check that out, let it. What is with all the rocks, and what is with the lack of enemies? There's no enemies! What is that going on? This is gonna be a gimmick. No? Not shatter that? Oh, that has to be special. I bet all the rocks are actually gonna turn into the enemies when I do something. I'm gonna trigger something and they're all gonna get up. Uh, 
um, the clockwork room with the summoning circle or something and chains. Huh. Oh, another library. Sure, why not? Oh, never mind. It's a bedroom. people here. Alright. Is this gonna be kind of like the City of the Dead? Hmm. Well, we gotta go out down the other way, so maybe we'll find a basement with a giant time machine in it. <clears throat> And then we'll have to work our way back up here, and, uh... I don't know. Or maybe it's the Scooby-Doo adventure, and we'll find out it was a guy in a mask all along. I'm pretty sure that these... These rocks are actually gonna be the monsters, somehow. They'll all get up and become golems. We know one's at the bottom of this stick, so we can just remember that when we find whatever it is we're looking for. Hmm. Another one of these! Another stain. <sighs> I was interrupted. So I have to start over. But I'll never get my... my first initial reactions to things again, so I spliced the first part in, so that's what you just watched, and now we're gonna try again to pick up where I left off. And since I haven't fought any enemies or done anything, it's not such a big deal, I guess. It's over very annoying. <laughs> okay, there's one item we need to make sure that we get again. We gotta make sure that we get that uh, guts. Honestly, I don't even think that the Odin artifacts are as important as this. As long as I got that, oh, I consider this a success already. <sighs> do, do you remember which path I went down? Down? Maybe? This is the way we were headed, right? Honestly, why does this room even exist? A staircase goes down, and then another, there's no paths, just staircase goes down, staircase goes up. Why is this room here? What is its purpose? <laughs> the architects were drunk. Okay. Yeah. Whatever. Alright. So... Okay. Alright, I think this is where we were. It's, uh, it's been a day. Um. save point. <clears throat> Why is there a save point here? <laughs> okay. Well, uh. I don't have the place mapped anymore. Oh no. Crud. Hold on. Look at this sneaky door here. Oh. I... are... Uh, uh, there's a whole bunch more... Um... Hmm. Well, well, what an unusual guest. What Aaron brings you to this place today? I was shopping for milk, and uh, I made a wrong turn somewhere. You are not human. Appear in your two form, evil thing. You understand me well, do I? I understand him. Oh my. I hunt for souls of men. What do you think to accomplish? 
Is there need to respond? It is obvious that your intentions are but to bury me, no matter what I say. I should destroy you. You hold a grudge against the living. I would ask you to hold off on that. Oh, great. Alright. Hmm. Is that how those are made? Well, you understand me well. I'm gonna write in my diary about this encounter. Oh, crap. I forgot that, yeah, I didn't heal them this time going in. Um, well, I'm sure it's fine. Probably. Do, uh... Do, uh... You even know healing? You don't. Well, um... Hmm. <clears throat> well, that's okay. We'll just do that. Then, um... I guess I'll use a banish. And I didn't even kill one of them. Wow, we're not doing great. Not so easy. Slash. Not even close. You guys aren't very good at this. Come on, trigger those first eggs. <clears throat> we need them. Yume really needs a little bit more work. She doesn't even have wave reaction. I think I gave her both of the uh, Emerald Blight bracelets, so if she levels up, she should get a whole ton of skill points. You missed. Why do you keep lightning it? That combo seems to work well. Swing with the uh, halberd, and then when it comes to counterattack, hit it with a sword. <coughs> the mage just blocked me. The mage doesn't even have arms, but he blocked me. Uh, I think we're good. Yeah. Okay. Well, that that wasn't much. You have served me well, my Iron Hair Yard. All right. As I expected, but if possible, please return to where you came from. It would be in both of our best interests. No. I thought not. Well, let's just see if we can exhaust you a bit before you reach me. Uh, we should probably have done something about that. Um, mm, yeah, I should have not left that portal to hell just open there. These fellows are necromancers, turning demon-embracing corpses into the undead. Demon-embracing? What is a demon-embracing corpse? I'm sure you'll see them if you don't move quickly. The mounds of corpses in this building, the dead and the tormented may have more company. <laughs> okay, so that that must be all the rocks, right? So they were corpses that look like rocks? Okay, sure, why not? Yeah, you're 800 XP away. Yeah, we gotta get you wave reaction. Um. Okay, well, uh, I guess now the rest of the dungeon can be a thing. Um. <coughs> oh, shit, chandelier. Okay, well that's the thing. Uh, oh, no, wait. Uh, pretend I know what I'm doing. That you didn't witness all this terrible clumsiness just now. Um, okay. Oh, no, no, oh. Uh, oh. I guess that's fine. Ah, junk. No, 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 wait. That's okay, we got this time. Okay. I don't think there's anything else up there. 
No, I don't think there's anything else up there. Okay. <coughs> we gotta look high. Um, I suppose I'm supposed to go use the save point, but uh, I can't really be bothered. Still suspicious of these stained glass windows, but that's probably because of the other city. The Lost City? Probably because of them. Alright, what kind of monsters are we up against? To my side, my noble Ein One of you is wearing these blue jeans, and two of you are wearing slacks. Well, we already know that uh, blue jeans is very fragile. So... Ice? Oh, hey, there you go. Okay, perfect. Well, that's about as good as the fight can go for us. We're kind of weak. It's weird playing with uh, these low-level characters that have crummy weapons. They're not getting three hits each, only a couple hits. And they just, uh... Well, they got a ways to grow. Let's put it that way. After having done the bonus dungeon and everything else, <clears throat> it's actually very different. It might not go so I think the third attack thing is what's throwing me the most. Okay, we need... Okay, this. I need this. Oh yeah. There we go. Okay, now you're gonna be formidable. Um... Crud, I don't remember what kind of person I'm supposed to send up this chapter. Oh well. Probably not important. Ah, I should probably use that book, actually. The Clearing of Healing. Black. <clears throat> yeah, I'll teach you to roll. Uh, it's just a good spell to have, and, um... Uh, you know, Stone Torch is cool and all, but I really like Frigid Damsel, so we're gonna go with that. <coughs> I'm not even entirely sure why your default is Stone Torch. Are you the Necromancer? How many Necromancers came out of that hole? Five? Am I supposed to kill all of them? Alright, let's see just how much better we are. Eh, uh, we hit a little bit harder. We hit harder. It's good. We're good. needs a few more such levels. Alright, and now... Oh, well, I bet it would have been a lot cooler if I had actually finished you off there, but alright, fine. I'll finish you off this turn. <coughs> Gives me another XP gem anyway. A spellcaster, Bellinus, Lawfer. It's kind of a good team. Oops. Oh shit. Ah. Ah. Okay. There we go. Ah. Uh, okay. There we go. Okay. Pop these off. We're gonna give this a quick round. Because I have XP in my XP orb. Uh, the only thing you actually need is that power bangle. We definitely need the. You can't do it with power bangles, it doesn't work. What was I thinking? Uh, anyway. Bellinus is a character I never really use, so it's kind of fun working with him for a change. Alright, well, you have that. I 
Yes, you should have them for a second as well. Give you 4k. Okay, perfect. And all of us should be more dangerous, and the subsequent battle should go a lot smoother. <clears throat> I think. Anything I can do to increase my, um... Well, if things go horribly off the rails, I guess I'll have this as a fallback. What about you? Nothing. Alright, fine. I might not even need the number of necklaces anymore, to be honest. Okay, anyway, um... Not that. Yep, nothing here. Yucks! Yeah, I'm pretty confident in us at this point. We're gonna be unstoppable here. Probably. Unless they get really heavy with the status effects, but I just don't expect that to happen. Hmm. Oh! Oh, hey, another enemy type. Okay, there are three different types of enemies here. To my noble <coughs> Ah, another type of wizard as well. Oh, you're the necromancer! Crud, you were hiding behind- Okay, do I need to find the night fiends and hunt them? Perhaps? Alright, well... One down? How tough can you possibly be? Going around romancing necks. I don't know. I don't think you can take much of a beating. <clears throat> okay. Item. Let me guess. F Fire Lance? Firestorm? It's gonna be spellful. No Stone Torch. Oh, okay. Eh. Alright, am I looking for knights? Maybe? Maybe that's what we're hunting? Or are we hunting these? Or do I just need to find a location that's opened up somewhere? This had a night fiend with it. Huh. I don't know! <clears throat> but it'd be nice if Yume would level up again. She could, she could use the added punch. I do believe she did frozen back row instead of the front row, but what what do you what can you do? Bicycle edge is still awesome. I could switch to lightning bolt, but Bicycle Edge is awesome. This time that, but that's okay, we got the kill anyway. Okay. Nice. I think I really need that. Uh, skill that boosts your accuracy when you level it up. I think that's what we're missing the most right now. Mm. You even have a weapons, would you? What? How can you tell? There might be one hiding back here. Aha! Because why even put enemies here, unless one of them has something in it? <clears throat> I'm probably just wasting my time. <laughs> I probably should just go hunt the boss room. It's probably going to be that room with the big circle and the chains. There's not even a thing here! Fine. Yeah, she's doing a bit better. Ah, so close. 
We almost beat it without taking damage. Oh, hey, there we go. Okay, we're leaving this fight better than we came in. Awesome. That's how we want it to go. I think I can just pummel you. Or you would just decide to block us. Again, I need that accuracy boost. The enemies stop blocking me all the time. Okay. Done. Is everyone all right, you may level up again. Come on! I need your icicle edge to have just a little bit more punch to it. Check this one. You have a necromancer in you? No, you have a thaumaturge. <clears throat> Just run. You call it a thaumaturge, but it's really more like a magician or maybe a harlequin. Where's one of the cooler enemy designs? The floating hands, the mask. I don't know, I like it. Oh, you're in the front row! How unfortunate for you. Oops, I thought I skipped the turn. I must have hit the wrong button. Oops! <coughs> well. It's still weird to me that I can get guts this early in the game. We're only in what? Chapter 3? Guts? Really? Okay, there we go. Alright, with the two emerald necklaces, this should be... Oops. Because I also want to give her some survival, just in case, you know, somebody throws stuff in the back row. And then any archer or something could make her sad. There we go, good. Uh... Is always good. Alright. Okay, I'll take the pen too. Okay, now she should be truly formidable. Alright, fine. One more. There's nothing in here, is there? There's nothing in this hall, is there? To my side, my noble Nope. Just Two zombies. So, lesser vampires. In other words, they're ghouls. I can't really tell the difference. Did you really get stronger, Yume? Uh, we need to work on that. I need an other scepter. Oh, hey, stop. Hmm. If I had other scepter, we'd one-shot everything. It would It'd be great! I have Janus, by the way. I'm actually considering uh, tagging him in. Cause, just because just I like him. Okay, something happened. Okay, we were supposed to kill, um... How would you even... What? <laughs> I don't... Okay, I don't know how to parse this. Uh, whatever. We're gonna go through. Um... Oh, can't put ice on the bookshelves. Or the wall. I feel like this room should do something. Ah, whatever. <clears throat> Take it. Uh oh. Ah, fork. Alright, fine, another one. Oh, hey, there's the Necromancers. 
Oh, uh, right, ambushed. Sort of. No spell casting or purify weird souls for me this turn. <clears throat> Alright, fine, whatever. Hit me with your best shot. Just fire lances! But you dropped a stone torch. Shouldn't you have stone torch? My fingers keeps pushing the wrong buttons. I wonder what game my thumbs think they're playing right now. There you go. Mm. You have paid the price for your evil. Huh. What the heck was that sound? <clears throat> Sounded kind of kind of oh, kind of like you know. Bells. Did I check up here? Uh, I guess that's not really okay. Okay, I went down, so I need to go up. I'm not missing anything, right? Well... I really doubt there's anything up here, so I'll just keep going. <coughs> Alright. I bothered freezing it and jumping over it. A back attack doesn't give me anything special or anything. Alright, we need Icicle Edge. It's a great spell. Alright, there you go. Check everybody's. You know what? I don't think our skills are that important. Let us go, my friends. <clears throat> you know what? We have plenty of skill points. I think we're fine. I think we're fine, right? All right, we're good. We're good. This would be a place where an important enemy could be. Oh, cuts it. <coughs> oh. Um. Yeah, it's Bell. With gargoyles on it. Very fancy. Uh, why is there even a cutscene for this? Is the Bell important? Do I need to fight the Bell? Hi. Impressive. Eh, hey, you seem somewhat tired. Why don't you take a rest? Playtime is over, now fight me. The dialogue in this particular area seems a little bit odd. Oh. Stubborn woman. <laughs> Whatever. Come to me, Dark Warriors. Battle uh, oh. Formidable adversaries. oh no, these are the splody things. Oh. Uh, you know what I'm gonna take a second. <clears throat> okay, and I'm gonna be all like... Oh, Might Potion for you! Oh, uh, why not? <laughs> Quiet chest! I got a Will-O-Wisp item! 
Uh, I don't like that. I just gave him a mic potion. Don't leave him out. You can drill will wisps Hey, they're troublesome if they explode! So perhaps a single special attack. <coughs> oh my gosh! A tutorial thing in the middle here. Rather than just encountering them in the Cave of Oblivion with no warning, this time it's like, let us tell you what these are and what they do. I choose Icicle Edge. As long as they don't all explode, we're okay, right? I don't know. I'll just... Okay. We are getting chewed up, aren't we? Not great at triggering the Purify Weird Soul, but we'll try. Especially if they combo guard me like that. That's bad. No! Oh, that, that wasn't so bad, actually. Oh, actually, no, we're fine. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. Guess I'm getting flashbacks from the Cave of Oblivion where my whole party just gets one-shotted out of nowhere by these things. <laughs> okay, now we're great. Uh, we'll just, uh, patch that up. And do better next time. Yeah, yeah we're fine. Everything's fine. Okay. Get him. Feel my wrath. Finishing strike. Extreme void. Extreme void. <laughs> How did you like that? That was good. All right, one more. Um, could you stop, stop hitting me with that? It, it kind of hurts. Why is it so good at guarding? We, we really, really need, um, <clears throat> oh yeah, heal her, not Valkyrie. We really, really need an accuracy boosting <laughs> skill. Are using them as finishing strikes here. Oh. <coughs> okay, that just leaves Mr. Vampire. Oh, okay, he's durable. Oh, okay, I thought he was gonna be uh, easy, but I guess not. Oh, good, thank you, finally. I was gonna give up and finally use an elixir. Alright, you're the only one who hasn't done your special attack. Get in there! <laughs> we are so laughably weak right now. Well, whatever. We got an item from him, we got an item from Will-O-Wisp. And kill for all of Odin's stuff. It's gonna be great. He's no longer using lightning bolts, huh? Done. Hmm. Well, he doesn't want to scream anything as he disappears. Is everyone all right? Oh, good XP. Lightning bolt and citrine. Yeah. Okay. Well, whatever. I think there should be final talking. Alright, what do you got? I don't remember this one. What is the incense burner of Darlis? No! I want it. <laughs> well, I mean, I guess that is what we'd find here. Okay, I'm sure there was no gargoyle statue in the game in hard mode. <clears throat> Well, what 
as we got here. Uh, I don't have the good transmute stuff. Mirror of Angel Kirio. Yeah. This one's worth a lot. By using the incense burner, the entire party's maximum hit points is raised by 100. However, it costs you two periods. What a cool item! I mean, 100 isn't really very much, but still, what a cool item! Holy crap. I'd have remembered if this had been in the game. Wow. Should be more like 500. I guess you want to wait until late game when you have everybody, but then 100 will become completely negligible. An extremely unpleasant looking statue of a gargoyle. but I... It's hard to say no to free hit points. <sighs> I mean, it's free hit points. It's so cool. Honestly, I should probably wait until I have the creation gem or something. Probably. What a cool item. Alright, that looks like a chain that I can grab, actually. No? You sure? I feel like... It seems like there's another path that goes up there. But if there is, I didn't find it. Well, I guess we're... Alright, I'm gonna dig around a little bit more. The bell should be up there, right? That's what the gears are for? It's the bell tower. Sap power! Eh, the sap guard is better. <clears throat> I'm jumping on your bed, cultists! Not a lot of cultists here, is there? What was that about a demon that was going to be unleashed on the world? We don't see a demon here. It's a vampire. The introduction description of this place was a total lie. I don't know. Maybe I'm just imagining things. I swear there's something up there. Hmm. How would you get higher, though? Oops, doggone, I did it again. Ah, uh, er, ah. Uh, uh. I don't know. have to be a path higher up. I don't think there is. Because there's just bedrooms that way. And, well, maybe the hallway has something in it I'm not seeing? There's no ceiling here. Okay, hold on. No. I really feel like I should be able to grab this chain. Or, is that what I meant to do? Oh, throw it. But throw it. Okay. No, that doesn't work. <laughs> I can't grab it. it. It looks like I could, but I can't. There's a second chain further up, but no. I guess we're just going to call it here. Yeah, 
no, I want to jump on that. Oh, uh, they would put something complicated here. You could totally jump on that. Oh, screw it, whatever. I'm just making it worse. Ah, alright, anyway. On to the next dungeon, which requires me to play through another chapter, but hey. I actually really think that the incense is cool, but the uh, gargoyle statue, I'm left wondering what it'll... Like, I guess we gotta have the uh, creation gem and creation... Uh, what was the other one? Creation crystal? The, the, two, the two things that make my transmute better, and see what it offers them, then... I'm curious about the mirror. I'm guessing it's an accessory. Hmm. Anyway. Just checking, make sure I'm not crazy. You said there was a demon being summoned here. Not a not a vampire, right? Demon worshipping Gorla cultist. We didn't see a single cultist. Unless it was the vampire. They have summoned forth a great demon. But there was no demon. Weird. It lies to us. Alright, anyway, whatever. Well. I guess that's the most interesting of the mystery dungeons thus far. We'll have to see what the next one provides. So, until next time and every time, this is Hadrix, signing off. Bye.